But we kick things off in the middleweight division. There is your tail of the tape, Phil Hawes, a highly respected young man coming into the World Series of Fighting, 27 years of age. He weighed in at 185 ready pounds. Josh Key, his opponent, 34 years of age. He weighed in at 184 pounds. And there you see the reach for both men as we send it inside the Decagon. Chaz Securo has the official introduction. So very rarely do we get two fighters making their debut in the organization, and that's ex exactly what we have tonight. Chael Sonnen, glad to have you with us alongside Joey Varner, Todd Harris. Here we Great go, fight. three rounds scheduled Great in fight. the middleweight division, Phil Haas and Josh Key. Boy, Phil Haas looks like his body's carved out of clay. This guy is very put together. They've called him a John Jones protege. He came to the ultimate fighter before we got him here at the World Series of Fighting. Mm. It's a pretty big compliment. He just takes a kick there by Josh Key. That came out a little faster than I expected, Todd. Key lands too quickly to the leg, and Phil Haas recovers quickly as well. You talk about strength and muscle on top of muscle, and that's exactly what Phil Haas is. High praise. Everyone's saying this kid has so much potential in the world of MMA, and he goes immediately to a guillotine, and Josh Key, a little bit of trouble here early on. Yeah, he is. I think he's going to give up full mount. I don't believe the guillotine's going to work. Though I have seen this one arm position work. Luke Rockholt goes to it a lot. Wow. And now we're seeing Phil Haas start to tee off here with the elbows. The epitome of ground and pound. Some of them getting through, some of them being blocked by Key. But Phil Haas action early and often here. One minute gone in this first round. Todd, you've always got to be careful of the rope-a-dope which all we mean by that is when a fighter gets to a position and uses all of his energy. Phil Haas is using a lot of energy there with those elbows. He's settled down now, because to your point, some aren't getting through. The referee McDonald is looking on. Josh Key's gonna have to advance position. Just covering up will save him for a little while, but it won't get him through completely. Here he goes. Haas looking for an arm bar coming out of that. Goes right to a takedown. Phil Haas wrestled at the same junior college John Jones did, Iowa Central. So this top position is something that he wants, Todd. So no worse for the wear right now as Josh Key has taken a lot of shots and still just two minutes coming up on two minutes gone away here in the first round. This one's scheduled for three in the middleweight division here at WSOF 31. Phil Haas in the red trunks in the dominant position. A perfect 3-0 record with two KOs and one submission. So his fights do not go the distance, just three pro fights in. Josh Key's in a bad position here. This is what we call the full mount. It's one of the worst spots you can be in an MMA. Referee McDonald is looking on. A lot of these shots, again, they aren't getting through. Right. But at the same time, what is intelligent defense? Is simply putting your hands up going to do it? That's a referee's call. But I can tell you now, it's not going to last for long. They say he's the hardest worker, Phil Haas, at the Jackson Wink Gym, and that's high praises for a gym that has the likes of some of the very best in the world of MMA. He trains with Cowboy Cerrone, and the one thing Phil Haas is not good at, swimming. Apparently, he does not know how to <laughs> swim. How is that possible in this day and age, Chael He Sonnen? sinks, huh? I don't know. Maybe right that muscle there, sinks. All right, now the referee this is, is bad. going to stop that's at this it. position, That though. is it. A quick hey, hey, hey. ending in the it's first over. round as Josh Key is not defending himself, and he looks just about as perplexed right now as Phil Haas just puts an end to this fight early in round number one, and that is it. Nothing to be confused about there. Intelligence defense is not just putting your hands up. When he gave up his back, when he went belly down and his back is what was exposed, that also took some of his coverage away. Now you can't put your arms up anymore. If you have the side of your head, your ears, that all becomes fair game. And Phil Haas started to tee off absolutely the right call. Welcome to the World Series of Fighting, Phil Hawes, as he picks up his fourth professional win. Another stoppage. We'll be back with the official decision when we return to Mashantucket, Connecticut. You're watching WSOF 31 only on NBCSN. Right now, we sit it inside the cage. Jazz Securo has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Kevin McDonald has stopped this fight at two minutes and 52 seconds of the very first round. Officially a TKO due to strikes. Your winner, Phil Megatron!